Welcome to Virtualize Everything, where we strive to educate and inform our viewers about technology and technology-related topics around virtualization. Tonight's video presentation is going to be a short one, and one that some of us may even find self-explanatory, but I've had a few viewers ask me for it. Here we are inside of our data center tab under storage. And today we're going to look at how to remove a storage container or storage drive that has been added to the Proxmox web interface from our Proxmox web interface. So today we're going to be doing this with the VE drive that I created in a previous video. This process of either editing or removing this drive is pretty simple. We want to select the drive by clicking on it. To edit it, we can click Edit and change some of the properties of this drive, like what it's actually going to be used for. But today's video is going to be more about removing it and how easy that is to help out some of our other viewers. So to do that, we're going to actually just click Remove. And then we can click Yes and the drive removes itself from both our drop-down over here and this window. That's all it is to removing a storage drive from our Proxmox web interface. I hope this helped any of you out struggling with the ability to remove your drive from your Proxmox web interface. If you have not done so, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing to help virtualize everything bring more content about virtualization to YouTube and our viewers. As always, have a good night.